You know, when you think of arthritis, an older person typically comes to mind. Imagine being diagnosed as an eight-year-old and how that would change your life in the years to come. That was Tyree Sally's struggle until a surgeon from Union Memorial Hospital gave her a new lease on life. It was painful to the point where I couldn't even hold a pen. Some days I would get sharp pains and paper would fall right out of my hand. After decades of living with arthritis, Tyree Sally decided she couldn't take it anymore. And you're, you're turning. She said she was diagnosed when she was just eight. A fist and then bend. As a child, I stayed in a protective bubble my mom created for me. So there was no after school sports. I couldn't do cheerleading. She was so terrified that I was going to break a bone. Your or... body attacks it. Now, nearly 40 years later, her quality of life had gotten so bad, she started looking for a surgeon. When you have a chronic illness like that, you, you just don't have the energy to even get dressed or, you know, go out and enjoy things. Maybe we should just check an x-ray of that. Orthopedic right. surgeon Dr. Michael Murphy says Tyree suffers from rheumatoid arthritis. It's an autoimmune disease that affects two to three million people, and it's not associated with aging like osteoarthritis. It's where you're immune cells that normally fight off colds and viruses and infections inappropriately go after your normal tissues for some reason. Dr. Murphy says Tyree was a perfect candidate. This is what her wrist looked like. For a wrist started. and elbow replacement, her joints were fused, severely limiting her mobility. It was fused to her radius so she couldn't rotate or twist. I couldn't brush my teeth the way I should. I couldn't do my hair. To lift a frying pan out of the uh, cabinet, I would use this hand and support it with this hand. So everything was two hands. There's a plastic piece in here that serves as a hinge. And now months out of two surgeries, of like Tyree has gotten her life back. Twist my wrist and maneuver the back of my head or shake my hair or something like that something I couldn't do before. Tyree's last surgery was in November on her elbow, and at last check, she's doing well. Now, there are weight restrictions on what you can lift, but as she said, she's just thrilled to have her life back.